How's it going guys? Welcome to the video. Today we've got version 2.0 of shooting at paper. We did the video before where we shot at paper and tried to see how many sheets of paper it took to stop a bullet. We did 22 LR bullets, 9mm and 10mm. And if I remember correctly, 22 LR got about 250 rounds, sorry, 250 sheets of paper. And then 9mm and 10mm both got about 500 sheets of paper. So one of these reams, a ream is 500 sheets of paper and it made it through one with both nine millimeter and 10 millimeter. What I wanna to do today is shoot at it with a 308 rifle and see the results, see how many sheets of paper it can get to. A 308 round is much larger, has much more stopping power, going a lot faster than all of those rounds we tried before. So I expect this to be a lot cooler and go through a lot more sheets of paper. So we have 500, 1,000, 1,500, 2,000, 2,500, 3,000. 3,000 sheets of paper that we're shooting at today and hopefully it doesn't go through all of this, but I don't expect it to. My prediction I'm gonna lay down right now is that it will go through approximately 1,200 sheets of paper. We'll say between 12, between 1,000 and 1,500. So essentially it'll go between two and three of these reams of paper. But just to verify our results from before, we're gonna shoot at it again with nine millimeter before we go up to 308. So like I said before, nine millimeter got through about 500 sheets of paper. We're gonna verify that before you step up. Here's nine millimeter. Let's do two more. Oh. Let's see if we can do at least one more. So here's what we're looking at. We've got our three entry holes and no exit holes. Interesting. So they didn't quite make it through. Let's see if we can cut into this and find those. So after tearing this off, we've got some bulging here in this paper. Oh, there's one of our bolts, very hot. There's one of the nine millimeter rounds. There's pieces of another. And here's one other right there. I think that's all of them. Oh, there's the last one right here. There's our last round. They all broke into pieces, so there's kind of fragments all throughout, but more or less, they went through about 500, give or take 50 or so. So we are now on the 308 rifle, shooting our 308 rounds and uh, standing way farther back because I can't even see anything out the scope when I'm that close. All right, let's do it. <laughs> that did some damage. So this is all messed up, but here we go. We got our first ream of 500, entry hole, exit hole, clean through. Second ream of 500, entry hole, exit hole, that's a thousand. Third, entry hole, exit hole much larger. It's starting to slow down and do a little more damage. And I guess it was like this, fourth entry hole, fourth exit hole, getting a lot larger, doing a lot more damage. Here's our fifth ream and entry hole right there. You can see some of the bullet, no exit hole. Looks like our bullet kind of broke up right into the fifth ream. We're setting this up to do it again, but that means that it got through 2000 sheets of paper. That's way more than I thought it would. I predicted between 1,000 and 1,500. We're at over 2,000. I'm gonna do it two more times just to verify our results. <laughs> that box went flying off the table. All right, before we look at the paper, this box went flying off. So, here we go. I, now I'm forgetting which one was which. I think the lower one is our new hole. Yeah, that looks about right. So, we have entry hole, exit hole, entry hole, exit hole, entry hole, exit hole, big exit hole. 
another one. Entry hole, exit hole right there. And our last, we have an entry hole in our final one. So that means that time it went through over 2,000. Um, see if you can find that bullet inside. There it is. That's a torn up, broken up bullet of our 308 right there. So that time it made it through 2,200 roughly. So that means that time it made it through roughly 2,200 sheets of paper. I'm gonna do one more time just to see if we can solidify and narrow down our results. All right, final attempt. We're gonna go on the right side a little bit. Nice. All right, so here's where we hit just a hair off to the right. Entry hole, exit hole, entry hole, exit hole. Uh, entry hole, exit hole. I don't know what's going on here now. I don't even know. And on this last one, So I believe this was our entry hole in the last one. And I think the bullet got stuck in there somewhere. There is a little bit of an exit hole here, but I'm not seeing it in the next one. So either it flew out, it's stuck in here, which it probably is, or it's just a hair inside of here. I'm not really sure. Alright, so someone else showed up at the range and I started talking to them and had to clean up my stuff because I was in their way. And then I kind of forgot to do my outro exit thing. So we're going to conclude it now while I'm driving out of here. This is a very bumpy road leading out of the range, rough gravel. Hopefully you can hear me okay. So anyways, I was amazed that even though the 9mm and 10mm only got through uh, 500 sheets of paper, the 308 went through not just double that, but four times that. It got through 2,000 sheets of paper, which is just crazy to me. A lot more penetration, a lot more power, and it's going a lot faster, of course, as well. So I hope you guys liked that video and uh, got something out of it, learned something maybe. And uh, if you want to see more stuff like that, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment down below with any suggestions on future videos, and uh, leave a like on the video. Helps a bunch. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Have a great day.